Canada said that an opposition Canadian lawmaker with family in Hong Kong became the target of an online disinformation operation from Beijing. Global Affairs Canada, the nation's foreign affairs ministry, stated on August 9th that it is highly probable that China orchestrated the misleading narrative campaign against conservative politician Michael Chong on the WeChat platform. The Canadian Foreign Ministry said it found out about an information operation on WeChat in May that featured, shared, and amplified a large volume of false or misleading narratives about Chom. Canadian officials made a rare disclosure regarding the allegations, noting that unequivocal proof that China ordered and directed the operation is not possible to determine due to the covert nature of how social media networks are leveraged in this type of information campaign. In the past, Canada has accused China of targeting Chom and his relatives in Hong Kong after he condemned the communist regime over human rights violations in China. As a result of these events, Canada expelled Chinese diplomat Zhao Wei in May, provoking China's counter-move to order the removal of Jennifer Lin Lalonde, Canada's diplomat stationed at its Shanghai consulate. In a media statement on Wednesday, Chom said the campaign against him was another serious example of the communist government in Beijing attempting to interfere in our democracy by targeting elected officials. He also renewed his appeal for a public investigation into allegations of China's foreign interference in Canada. Chom sponsored a successful motion in 2021 that declared China's treatment of its Uyghur Muslim minority genocide. Beijing sanctioned him the same year. This recent international discord stems from a report by the Globe and Mail newspaper in May, which cited an intelligence assessment indicating that China sought information about Chom and his family in a presumed effort to make an example of him.